just one of these lots pays for my entire trip there that day. So Hey YouTube, welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Rob, also known as the Chesapeake Picker. I'm a part-time reseller based out of Chesapeake, Virginia. Had a pretty good weekend going out here. I have uh, 13 packages going out right now. Let's go ahead and take a look at those. So if you haven't seen, I've been selling a whole bunch of DVDs for a buddy of mine. Uh, I do this stuff on consignments. We split the profits 50-50 after any uh, fees and shipping and all that stuff. So these are all going out with free shipping. These are the different buyers. Most of these are small profits, but I do have a couple good ones. First one here, this is the Richard Gear Collection. Went out for a lot better than I thought it would here. It's for $15.99 with free shipping. Um, it is new and sealed. It'll go up for $2.80. And here's an old movie here as well. Well, not too old. This is Lone Star with uh, Chris Christopherson, Matthew McConaughey. Sold for $15 with free shipping. Got another one of these landscape lights here. This is uh, from Malibu. I got nine of these at the thrift store for they were a buck ninety nine each, uh, and they sell for fifteen dollars plus shipping. They make it out uh, just into that priority mail. Go in a twelve by six by six box, and that will go out for probably about eight bucks. Got now one lot of these left. They're these Kenra volume hairspray, like little travel size. They got little dents and stuff on them, which is in the listing. Um, I got these for a quarter a piece, so I have $1.25 into the lot, and they sell for $27 with free shipping. Um, they cost usually about six bucks to ship these out, so I have one left. These came from the Amazon Overstock store. I got a whole bunch of stuff there, pretty cheap, uh, and I've made uh, quite a bit of money on this. Just one of these lots pays for my entire trip there that day, so not too bad. 20 bucks uh, profit there before any fees are concerned. This one here is chipping away at the big lot of Redskin stuff I bought. There was a guy who had uh, died and his friend inherited all of his Redskin stuff. And I've been selling through that. I bought the entire lot for $500 and I've made now about $2,000 out of that deal. This is just a wall hanger sign, thin vinyl, nothing special on that, but it did sell for $19.99 with free shipping. When I'm shipping something like this out, all I will do is take two pieces of cardboard that are just a little bit bigger than this, tape them around the entire perimeter, and it will go out first class. You do want to make sure that you're not too long, because I believe if you're over, I think it's 27 inches, uh, don't quote me on that, but it's around that, you cannot go first class. This one is not, uh, but there was one like a street sign. I had to play with it a little bit and cut the edges off, so it still made it out into first class. Picked up this Levi's uh, size XL denim sleeveless jacket. I got this for $8.98 at a thrift store. It was a new one I had never been to before and it was the only thing I found really that was worth my time that day. I am gonna go back and check it out, but their electronics and stuff were almost retail price. So I stayed away from that. A lot of their toys and stuff weren't so great. But so this one for $8.99 and $8.98 I bought it for and it sold for $35 plus shipping. This thing should be able to fold up nicely and go out into a, pat, a uh, flat rate envelope. Not a big sale here. I got this uh, Lionel automatic gravel loader. This is like a vintage train accessory type thing. I had this up for $10 plus shipping um, or best offers. It is got some broken pieces in there. The box is in okay condition, nothing fantastic. Somebody sent me an offer for five bucks and I just kind of went ahead and took it. It's gonna cost three times as much to ship this to the buyer as it did for them to uh, buy the item itself. So being it's broke, took a deal on that. A while back I was at a thrift store and I picked up these books. This is uh, Madeline Albright's Memo to the President Elect, uh, signed copy of this book. So I got her signature in here. Where are we at? Got her signature in here. This must have been part of some kind of a book signing and I got a bunch of leftovers. So I had nine of these. This is the second one to go out. I list them for thirteen or $17 with free shipping. I had to put this up on Mercari. Somebody sent me an offer of 13 and I went ahead and accepted that. It'll cost three thirty-three to ship out. And I got only have 45 cents into it and I still have seven more to list. I put them up one at a time just so I'm not taking away from my own market share by having all of these listed books by uh, the same signed author up. 
Uh, next thing I got up here is this pair of Nikes. These are Nike Air Max Torch 3s. I picked these up at a garage sale about a week ago for $2.50 and I sold them on Facebook Marketplace and they're going to be shipped out. This is the second item I'm shipping out through Facebook. Uh, $30 plus I charged $15 for shipping. Um, these are pretty light. I don't think it'll cost quite that much, but I haven't looked to see where they're going yet. I picked up two of these at the uh, CHKD chkd thrift store for two dollars and 98 cents a piece they're like these uh, cake pinata cake pans still new and sealed and they sold for 14.99 plus shipping got this xbox uh game this is original xbox conquer live and reloaded uh pretty desirable game here i got this for a dollar and 98 cents and it sold for 27.95 plus shipping as I've had every day since I've started listing these, I got a big old lot of DVDs going out. Nothing special as far as titles go here, but there's probably about, oh, like $9 to $10 worth of profits in this. Not super profitable, but this came out of the big lot of Redskin stuff I got. Is this Marky Mays uh, Washington Tales from the Washington Redskins book. This sold for $5.50 with free shipping, uh, $2.80 to ship this out. Got this Lord of the Rings toy. This is Saruman. Uh, picked this up at a garage sale with a whole bunch of Lord of the Rings stuff. Most of it new in the box. I've only got a couple left. This one I had for, I think, $19.99 plus shipping. Somebody sent me an offer of $14.00. I went ahead and accepted that. They didn't pay, so I had to open up an unpaid buyer claim, but they sent me a message saying, oh, sorry, I forgot. I'll pay you first thing Monday, and they paid, and it, it will go out now. This one here is the best sale of the day. I'll flash this up on the screen because I'm not going to unpack it. It's this New Wave Infrared Oven. I picked this up at the thrift store. Um, it was new, open box, so it had never been assembled or anything. It's all still wrapped up in the plastic. I got this for $6.74, and it sold for $89 plus shipping. The buyer is $132.99 all in on this, and I had it for probably just over a week, so that was a very good pickup. Thanks as always for checking out the channel. Please remember, hit that like button, subscribe down below, leave me any questions or comments. I'll get to them in a future video. Thanks to all my new subscribers. I've seen several of you guys pop up in the last few days. I'm starting to get on to my next goal of 200, so I'd like to get there soon. Still got a ways to go. With your guys' help, I can get there. Still 50% of my viewers are not subscribed to the channel, so if you aren't, please remember, hit that button, and I will see you guys next time.